Have you ever wondered why old TVs look different compared to HD video? Well, it's all about progressive and interlaced scanning. Back in the old days with broadcast TV, the bandwidth was very limited. In order to solve this problem and increase the speeds of transmission, interlay scanning was created. What interlay scanning actually was, is instead of carrying all the data from one frame in one, the bandwidth was actually split in half because they showed the even lines first and then the odd lines that actually made up an entire frame. It basically created two fields of information per frame. It did, however, cause a few issues and aberrations in terms of motion and motion blur because each scan was a little delayed compared to the previous one. Modern displays and cameras, however, use progressive motion. Progressive scanning is when the entire frame is shown in one go. By showing the entire frame at once, without this distinction of even and odd, the image is much sharper, crisper, and it doesn't have the aberration of motion blur issues that is created by interlaced scanning. Cinema has always been progressive especially when we use film cameras and every single image is exposed as a particular frame on that footage and it is played back in the same 24 frames per second speed and the entire frame is shown at once. This is exactly why we associate progressive scanning with cinema and we associate interlaced scanning with TV. Interlay scanning is still used in TV and broadcast today because of the lower bandwidth that is still convenient. Next time you see that jagged combing on TV and old broadcast, you know that that is because they used interlay scanning. Modern films and cinema are always progressive.